Now, uh, the, the trees on the right, everybody, look at these trees on the right. These are called swamp bloodwood. And the swamp bloodwood is family to mangroves and cypress. Ah. Now, if you understand, mangroves has like legs. Mm -hmm. Mangroves and cypress has like uh, elbows. Are we close to it yet? Yeah. 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 All right. And uh, these trees, the cypress and the mangroves and the bloodwood, they have very powerful roots that is able to filter out the salt because the water here is very salty. So it's able to filter out the salt. Another reason this grows alongside the riverbanks is because it keeps, it keeps the riverbank from erosion. It minimizes erosion. So these are some of the reasons. And right here, look at this. This is elephant ears. And this is growing as an air plant. Look at the roots suspending in the air. Parasite? Air plant, no. Parasite mm -hmm. is a dangerous plant that can kill its host. Mm -hmm. This is an epiphyte. Uh, epiphyte and saprophyte has a symbiotic relation with the host. Ah. Mm -hmm. But parasite can kill its host. Kill it. So we're looking at an epiphyte and air plant. When we get up the river, we're gonna, I'm going to incorporate a little walk for you. We're going to see saprophyte. 